you've grown so fast, my sweet child. The time that's passed is forever in my mind. Seems to me. Thank you so much for your company this morning. A Kiwi children's songwriter and author Chris Sanders has just released his debut album. These memories make you and me. And it's gone straight to number one across the iTunes and Google Play album charts and to number two across all genres. And we are told it sits above the new works from Eminem and Slash. That is quite something. <laughs> Welcome back to the Cafe, Chris. Thanks yeah, for having me back. Welcome back. It's great to be back, here, mate. Thank you. Incredible. Now, this is your third time on the show. And it is, It yeah. feels like as many months, but I know it's been a little <laughs> longer than that. Um, you joined us last year for your book, Angel Star. Yes. And song about a little girl waiting for her baby sister to arrive. That's right. And then earlier this year, you are partnering up with St John for your, your song, Dial 111. The, one, one, the very catchy Pick song. Pick up the phone. Yeah, and Dial 111. Yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that was pretty that. cool. Yeah. Um, so how did you get into the singing and the writing for kids? So people might have missed that. Well, how did you get into it? Um, well, it was, it was actually uh, by accident. Um, my my daughter, had, uh, uh, like with Angel Star, I've explained before, like she she wanted a little sibling, so she came up with the story about picking a star in the sky one night, and so she actually went outside and she said, "I want that star to be my little brother or sister," and I thought it was really cute, and I wrote this song, Angel Star, about it, and um, I was I never intended it to be a kid song. I was actually recording it to be on an, on an adult's album, and I was recording it. I was like, "It's a really special song. It needs a little special touch to it." So so I ended up deciding to turn it into a children's book and that kind of kicked off my my children's um, songwriting career I guess and um, and from that then like you say the the ambulance song came along which was um, a bit more wiggles you know it's quite quite um, upbeat and um, and now this these yes. memories make you and me your debut album how yeah. cool is it to know that you've got a whole album of your work out yeah. there yeah I think it's just every musician's dream uh, like I guess like like an author to bring out a to bring out a book um, it's it's every musician's dream to bring out an album at some point in the life and um, yeah I'm just really chuffed and, and I'm happy that it's done so well as, as yeah. well as, uh, yeah above yeah. Eminem and Slash that's amazing yeah. Yeah. Um, you don't just do things by half so you don't just bring an album out you've released it alongside <laughs> a book as well so tell us about yeah. the gorgeous pictures yes so um, actually um, my, my cousin Natalie Connor she, she works for Madame Tussauds in, um, in London um, and she was taking a year off work just to kind of do a few other things and, and she actually posted a picture on Instagram of like an illustration she'd done and I thought wow that's amazing like I'd love love it if she did my next book and so we had a chat and um, it ended up she, she just loved the idea and so she ended up illustrating it for me so it's, we've kept it in the family this time a little bit more so um, but she's done it she's done a great job and it's a bit different like this this is 14 songs in total so there's eight sing-along songs and there's six lullabies that parents can use to help the kids get to sleep but but all the sing-along songs have got their own illustration um, rather than it being like one song with lots of illustrations so it's um, so it's kind of it's quite nice I can see why it's doing so well because every parent needs a book and some music to help the kids go to yeah. sleep so you yes, can yeah. it on the head there. <laughs> I mean they're not all sleepy tracks but but yeah it does have that mix on there yeah how hard was it, you know, from Angel Star to actually go and make a full album? Because, you know, making one song's hard enough, doing yeah. 14 of them. Um, I guess the, the biggest thing's always cost. Uh, right. You have to, you know, get musicians in a studio. And um, and so I was lucky Enzo on Air came and, and they liked the concept. Um, and so they, they gave me the funding to finish it. I'd already recorded a little bit of it, but they gave me that funding to kind of push it over the edge and, and to promote it as well. So that was that was really cool. And um, it's nice. It's, a, it's, it's quite a, It's actually... A, People say it's a concept album, so every single story goes from. So the first song is about holding your baby and you're looking at your baby for the first time, Pretty and locking thing. eyes with them, and then it goes all the way through to basically um, looking back and thinking, "How did my kids grow up so uh, quickly?" Oh, it's uh, so, and everything in between, it's like you know, kids waking up in the night and and having to get them back to sleep. The first time you've got a, you, your child gets sick and you're kind of going, "Oh my God, what do I do with this human being?" You know. <laughs> so, yeah, I love it's kind it. Of, yeah, it's, oh, it's, no, it's, well, it's, yeah. it's awesome. Yeah. I totally relate to you. Everything you just yeah. said. Oh, my baby gets a big hey. Well, yeah. thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, pleasure, yeah. Chris Sanders' new children's book and album, These Memories Make You and Me, is available now from leading bookstores around the country.